Novak Djokovic has just won the Olympics. He's just won the last thing that he hasn't got in his trophy cabinet, the Olympic gold medal. That's now completed. Let's have a look at what that means for his career, but also the reaction we've had on Twitter and some of the uh, comments from both Djokovic and Alcaraz post-match. You can see here from Oli Tennis, we've got all of the achievements, the Australian Open, the French Open, Wimbledon, US Open, ATB Finals, all nine 1,000 Masters events. He's got the Davis Cup, he's got the ATP Cup, he's got the 500, uh, a 500 event and a 250 event on the ATP, and now the Olympic gold. Take a bow, Novak Djokovic, there it is. Everything's complete. He's done everything that the tennis game has to offer. Let's go have a look at what Alcaraz had to say after the match. This is what he had to say. It's painful to lose the way I lost this match. I had my chances to probably be up in the match. I couldn't take it. Novak was playing great. He deserves this. In the tough moments, he increased his level. He played unbelievable shots. An un unbelievable game. I'm a bit disappointed, but honestly, I leave the court with my head held really, really high. I gave everything I had fighting for Spain, and it was everything to me. I'm proud with the way I played today. So there you go. That's what he had to say after the match. And this is what Novak Djokovic had to say after the match. He says, I don't know. I'm overwhelmed with everything I'm feeling right now. Feeling different emotions, too proud, too happy, thrilled the possibility to win a gold for the first time in my career for my country. Arguably the biggest success I had. I won probably everything there is to win in my individual career. Winning Davis Cup and particularly a gold medal at the age of 37 for Serbia is unprecedented. I'm just starting my celebrations. I can't wait for what's to come in the next 48 hours. So that's Djokovic after the match. Uh, he also took to Eurosport and he says, incredible battle, fight. I honestly, when uh, the last shot went past him, uh, it was only moment I could I thought I could win the match. He keeps on coming back and asking me to play my best tennis. It was, uh, it was a fair to finish both sets in tie breaks. I don't know what to say. I'm still in shock. I put my heart, soul, body, family, everything on the line to win the Olympic gold medal at the age of 37. The pride to play for Serbia. Carlos and Rafa love to play for Spain. Andy for Britain. Roger for Switzerland. You see, you just see the reactions when they win. It's special. It's different. And then the French Open have come out and said, Novak and Carlos, thank you for this display of highest quality. So there it is. That is the reaction from both the players post-match. Uh, and a little bit of an online uh, reaction as well from the French Open, the Roland Garros, which is where it is being played. And of course, from uh, the, some, from a stats point of view, what it means, Novak Djokovic has completed everything in tennis. But let me know down in the comments below if you're watching this later. What does Djokovic have to do next? Is there anything for him left to do? There's a couple of records there. I mean, you could probably try and get most titles of all time. There's still that outright lead in the 24 race to the you know 24 titles or Grand Slam race. He's equal with Margaret Court. Does he need 25? Probably not, but does he want it? Probably. So we can be undisputed on that as well. But man, Novak Djokovic wins the gold and he's done everything in tennis.